trig function cotangent of the inverse sine of negative one half. We're going to solve this here. Oops, let me delete this. First, solve this by solving the internals of what's inside the brackets. This is the same thing as sine of x is equal to negative one half. What does x have to equal to? But because it's the inverse sine, we it's bound between negative pi over two and pi over two. The only place where sine is equal to negative one half is equal to negative pi over six. So in this case, x is equal to negative pi over six. And you're going to plug this in for cotangent. So the cotangent of negative pi over six. Well, negative pi over six is roughly this. It's going to be negative one root three, two. And cotangent is equal to adjacent over opposite, which is equal to x over y. So in this case, the cotangent is going to be equal to uh, root three over negative one or simply just negative root three.